Hello and welcome back to Europa Universalis. My name is Mentris and welcome back to this uh, Irish world where Munster is pretty close in making Ireland, but we also have one big challenge to go. So in this episode, I kind of want to focus on these green isles, the the isles created by Denmark. Denmark attacked Scotland at that moment. England also attacked and well, I couldn't stay out. So I also attacked Scotland and we kind of did a pretty good war. Now we have to find new allies. As you can see, oh, Denmark attacked Livodian. We got Granada in the south and I need to find allies that will help me against, uh, against England. That's going to be the biggest problem. France is my preferred ally, but he doesn't like me that much. And the reason is because I rival Brittany. That, that's one problem. And I'm allied to their, their enemy, England. So instead, the plan is to ally Castile. And then, once once we've allied Castile, we are going to try and be friends with France because they they don't really hate us. So the aggressive expansion will fall away. So there are a lot of things that will help us in the end. The Brittany thing is not helping, and I am not sure. I can pick another if I can pick another rival I, I can you can easily add so that that won't be possible until the 1506 that's damn that's like 20 years all right in the meantime we should have taken the aisle so that that problem will fix maybe we even go for that and maybe something special will happen because Ooh, Hamburg expanded. Uh, because, well, that happened last time. This is also kind of strange. England is not in a war, but unloading troops there. I guess that's a little bug. So let's unpause the game. And first thing first, we are going to send a diplomatic relationship we're still improving with England. I need to keep that sharp. And uh, we are going to have some rebellions coming up. So I'm not training you guys. So that's going to be a problem because we got a little money problem. But I first want to let them spawn and then we'll see what we'll do then. Let's see, is there anything we can do? Grab Monopoly, no. Ask for a contribution. I guess the nobility. There's really nothing we can do. And the one thing I need is money. And the only way we can get that is by getting the interest gone. And to improve our land a little bit. So let's see you guys fighting. That's kind of funny. You're fighting nothing, I guess. So let's see how long this is going to take. Cognac is going to spawn in two point. And Stigger. So these are the two. I want to bring the army at least close to that. 3.6 years and 4.1 year. We got a lot of rebels coming in. That that's kind of annoying. All right, so we can recall that, and now we can fabricate a claim. That's going to be the next thing on the list. We are still constructing cords. That's also something we need. Uh, build a spy network. We still have a lot of corruption. How much corruption do we? No, we don't. Yes, we do. That's also costing me 0 0.25 ducats, so that's 
costing us as well. It's only one corruption, so it's kind of annoying. But nothing we can do about it. Let's see how our, we are all... Big old Catholic. Ooh, yeah. What happened here? Because... Ooh, Portugal attacked. Are you attacking? You're attacking Tunis. That's kind of interesting. Don't see that often. And in the last... Mm, last video we did something nice with the idea so I kind of want to move forward on that colony venture and right so we've caught one province now five point so the rebellion is kind of dropping not in that one Pause the game. What's it? We can feel it in the wind soon. Our queen's lead will be nothing more than a dream remembered as the civilized tradition dies out before the onslaught modernity. The, the world is changing, but for now, for one last time, let the Knights of Munster ride. Because that's going to cost me. What splendor? Stability, sailors, manpower, prestige, legitimacy. I don't know what that is. Splendor. That's interesting. I don't mind. I don't know if it's a typo or something like that, but I want to do it for the army moral. Alright, so the rebellion is slowly dropping, and that's a good thing. Some rebellions, at least. Welsh March. Alright, so I did expect it only. I didn't pay that much attention to it, so now my maintenance is kind of crappy. Alright, let's the armies move to the north. I need to get the moral up. That's kind of annoying. I don't want to get kicked in the butt because of my low moral. Alright, so the moral is going up. I'm losing money, that's not good. Alright, let's see what we can do. Yes. Alright, pause the game. Our use of privateering to strengthen our position on the oceans has not gone unnoticed by the unsavior individuals who raid the ships without the blessing of the king. Well, preferred not to see many similarities between our legitimate authorizations. Uh, Prisons and these pests, some of them you see quite a few. All right, so we get more privateering. Do I, I kind of like having more prestige? Uh, no, we are not going to do that. All right, so almost the moral is almost up. Alright, let's go in and let's see how we kill those rebels. And we had to take a big loan. Alright, so which are the next rebels? One point Scottish Shepherdists. And I kind of want to be there before they spawn because of the castle. Ooh, they no, that's not that. That one, zero point six years. So I know we're losing money, but I don't have a choice, I guess, at the moment. Oh yeah, we were fabricating 
claims. That's something we could do in the meantime. Fabricate the claim on the inner. I guess the inner. Yes, that's the one. All right. All right. So I kind of want to have the cheapest one. One where I have to send the most or less global settlers coexist. Yes, that's the one. All right, this is going to give us some money. It's not going to be enough, uh, but it'll have to do for now. All right, let those separatists. Drop in 0 0.6 years. The Emperor has enacted an Imperial reform. Alright, well, that's one that normally happens. So I don't really mind. Two more cores needs to be done. Alright. Ooh, it's a quite bigger army than I expected. At least we won, but it was a close one. The next one is the, which, oh, that's, those are these two. And I guess this one's supply limit 25. What's the tree, 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 and that's tree, tree. Ooh, that's an ugly one. I hope my army does reinforce fast enough. As expected, my army did not. That's kind of annoying. But I guess we do what? I guess they have a lot of rebel trouble at the moment. Do they? Unrest is pretty close. Oh, that's nice. I hope the English will finish this. Come on, English. Yep, there's the English troops coming. That's good, that's good. That's the way I like to have it. And you just walk across my land. All right, so in the meantime, we can declare war. I have no diplomat sent. That's kind of annoying. Uh, stop that one. Because we can do a little more in the meantime. Alright, so we got that part done. Not going to make as much money, but oh well. This one will also make us only 0 0.1 ducat, so it's kind of not worth it but tell me what you think in the comment about how I'm doing that all right let's see you got an edict the Isles become prosperous local development minus 10 goods produced all right good for you declare war take the Isles It's kind of nice they have their armies there. I wonder if they are going to attack me. Alright, let's save up some points. I guess we cannot save up that many points, but oh well. Country is in war. I got still a few provinces.
kind of wonder if I need to attack them or... Ooh, Her Majesty the Queen is, of course, a constant companion and good advisor in her own right. However, apart from that role, our Queen is also rep representative of the Crown to the O'Reilly House and versa. Visa versa. At time, this is not a, an arrangement without benefits. So, I think we the O'Reilly is offered to provide as a gift counselor I wonder I wonder do I have to pay for this one I kind of want to know Moss recruiter I don't want a Moss recruiter so I, I just go with that one Excellent. More trade efficiency. So the siege is going pretty well, but we have to take another loan. That's kind of unfortunately. I could kind of make this a facile. That would be nice. You become a vessel for me. And now you can have your rivalry. They don't want this. That's kind of pity. Because I do want that. Because I'm not going to be stupid and attack them from the water. That would be... that would be stupid. No, I don't want to build a relationship. I want to improve our relationship. Alright. Let's see, they want to pay me... I don't want the 15 ducats. I want you to be my vessel. But that's going to take some time, I guess. I don't mind. This is really kind of interesting, and I, I'm wondering if... They're really that low on... Oh, they're drilling! Oh, that's interesting. Right, well, let's use the points. If you know any other good idea to use the points in, I would really, really like to know. Because we are already spending. Yeah, we got eight in all. No, let's see. I could also just take the inner aisles. But it's going pretty fast. Right, are they going to transport troops? Um, how much money do we have? Do I still... Yeah, that castle is up. Repay the loan and... Put that castle down again. That would save us some ducats. The interest is kind of killing me. 
but as is the war as well so we can keep this up just a few more months I don't want to take up another loan that's that's then I would rather go for another war Then I would rather go for another war. That's definitely not going to happen. Oh, I do need to unpause the game. Damn, that happens so often. I want to have a big sign in, in the middle of the screen. You're on pause. So, unpause the game. That would really, really help me. Right, we got... I can call it an ally. That's kind of funny. I don't want England. I could go for Norway, but... No, this is not going to work. So, let's see... Uh, what else can we do? Clear the offers, or I want that one. You don't have any more money, I guess not can do that. I cannot make you a vessel. Uh, give up the claims and this war perhaps. That's kind of funny. So I can do that but I cannot know because I haven't taken it. Uh, Alright, send the demands. So we've got a little bit of piece of land make a core and now I need to get my army back to this mainland and also I need to really need to make some money because I kind of want to have the big ship and for the big ship the explorer ship build a flagship that would be nice no I need an early carrack have a ship in that way, how much that's going to cost me a lot monthly. Alright, let's speed it up and... Ooh, noble families... I wonder, I cannot do the mat. I want to know in the comment down below, if you think this is a smart move, minus 15% because I am making now 2.9% 0.91% so 15% would be like uh, 29 I guess 34 0 0.34 ducats and this will be for how long for how long how long does this say it's going to be until 1508 so it's going to be 12 20 years so, oh, that's the same amount of money. So, uh, I get 31 point, I guess, yeah, that's the mat. All right, so I'm going to do accept. Because that way I can pay off, oh, I cannot pay off a loan. I was hoping that I would be able to pay off a loan. Well, we could go, what's treason against Muncher? What? Recruitment is out of necessity. What happened? Recruitment is out of necessity. Something that has to be... Has to somehow decentralize affairs. Oh my god. Nobles in the capital and... Then they are responsible to turn up the a set of numbers of men in the various provinces under their control. This is a system that some extent relies on trust, as the central government is not involved in the detail of the countryside mustering, uh, musterings. And the only form of control we have are the often sporadic inspections and the army itself conducts oh my god what just happened lose 2.5 percent and a modifier as well
this is kind of funny because I guess he paid Mercs. Oh, we must punish. I don't mind losing the nobility because they are way too high. Local unrests. And that's 25. Yeah, I definitely need that one. I don't mind losing that one. Alright, so we got something to think about uh, in the next video are we going to go explore or are we going to uh, pay off our debts and find a new target to attack because i kind of want to attack this little island over here and that one but i need ships for that i got light ships i have only one trade ship we would be able to get there but I'm not sure we could also do some exploring first so put it down in the comment down below what you think we should do should we go and go on exploring or should we find ourselves some allies maybe still has too many diplomatic relationships so that plan is not going to work in a short time uh, we cannot attack this one as well i kind of want to attack norway that would be one possibility but for that we need to attack denmark and i'm not sure if England would support me on that one so let know in the comment down below and tell me what you think what we should do because we have a lot of options and a lot of things to think about thank you for watching and my name is Madurys and see you guys all in the next episode